You could call this the strongest village in India. A thousand push-ups? No problem. Some claim they can even do 2,500. Lifting a 300 kilogram motorcycle like a box of books. Men of all ages, sizes and levels of strength train together in the outskirts of New Delhi, two hours in the morning and two in the evening. So this is what you call a traditional Indian gym. You've got a mud pit, some bricks, a rope and just a whole lot of peer pressure. For generations, men clad in loincloth, wrestling in mud pits have transfixed spectators in rural India. Traditionally, we're a farming community, but we always had a passion for wrestling. When there was no television or nightclubs, wrestling was the only source of entertainment, he says. <laughs> Vijay Tawar wanted to win an Olympic medal, but when that didn't work out, he found opportunity at home. Fifteen years ago, there was an influx of nightclubs and there was a huge demand for bouncers. So I thought, why not, he says. Tower also trained hundreds of other young boys from the village. Their sole motivation, bouncering, as they call it here, in New Delhi's nightclubs. Where is this craze coming from? We have a healthy lifestyle, we earn good money. What else does one need in life? He asks. They're strict vegetarians. They also don't drink or smoke. But how do they reconcile traditional village customs by day and modern city lifestyles by night? We adjust. He says, when there's a need, people figure it out. For a bunch of brawny men, they're a pragmatic and happy lot. So we've managed to request them to stop working out for a few seconds to take this picture. Yeah! Sunima Uras, CNN, New Delhi.